Hello ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the channel and the Elden Ring playthrough. Today we are going to be taking a dip into the Siofro River well. And this is where we we're supposed to meet live. However, I don't know where the hell he is. I tried looking it up and he said that I needed to find a spirit well, which are those things that you use with a horse to jump really high. And he's going to be on the edge of a cliff somewhere and then he's going to be like, yeah... I need you to check on Celavis because he's a bitch. And then we do that, and then there's like the whole thing. Um, but yeah, first and foremost, I need to get through this area. I need to find that spirit well. And... Or is it Spirit Spring? One or the other. I don't know. It's the same thing. These guys are pretty slow. And they're kind of like stupid. Because yeah, look at that aggro range. They saw me and they just immediately gave up. It's a very beautiful area. I will say, when I first came down here, when I was playing on my PlayStation profile, dude, I was astounded by how just, like, aesthetic this was. It was like another world. Because this, the sky is purple. There is another sky underneath of the ground. <laughs> which doesn't make any sense, but it's just like, hey. You know, that's... That's Elden Ring for you. A lot of things don't make sense. I tweaked my guy's face a little bit. I don't know. There's something about it that I just can't, like... I don't know. I, I can't put my finger on it. There's something that I'm not too happy about. But what can you do? Until somebody makes a mod that puts Tengen himself in the game. You know, it's just... I gotta deal with it. But yeah. Alright. We're heading up. I have been through this little part up until the next bonfire or side of grace i should say but yeah look at that view that is so pretty if i had my um magnifying glass i would or my binoculars i should say i take a nice little screenshot for the thumbnail of course and then i put something lewd on it clickbait you guys because i know how horny these elden ring players are <laughs> oh lord i gotta get away from this giant fucking crab Alright, so, yeah, again, they said keep to the right, and there should be a spirit spring. Um, I don't know. I don't see it anywhere. I do know that there is a boss over here. The, um, the old deer boss, or whatever it's called, I don't know. We gotta light all the flames. There we go. So we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven more to go. Fantastic. Here, before we continue doing that, though, let me check around here. Because maybe it's on this edge? I don't see anybody except for these phantoms. I know that there's a, a shield over here, right? Yeah. No, not that one. This one, right? There we go. Inverted Hawk Heater Shield. That's a reference to Berserk, everybody. Look at that. The more you know. Uh, definitely not up here. I don't see him. At all. Alrighty. We gotta light these fires, and we gotta do it quick a rooney because this heat is killing me. This is like a, a timed session. <laughs> a timed play session. Because my, my little AC unit that could is not doing too well. In this uh, 80 to 90 degree heat, bro, I know, I know they're gonna be like some people from Arizona or California or some shit. Like that's nothing. You don't know what the power of true heat is. <laughs> Shut up. It's hot down here, or up here, I should say. It was also hot in Miami when I used to live there. Trust me, I know. It was summer all the time there. You can't tell me that I don't know true heat. Ooh, what's this little item over here? Don't mind if I do. A lump of flesh? Eee so that's two. What the fuck? There's a giant crab here too? Um, I'm pretty sure... I'm just gonna go in like zigzags across these areas to make sure that I'm getting everything. That I'm getting all the altars. Because I don't want to have to backtrack more than I need to. Oh my goodness. Leave me alone. Perish. Goodbye. Sayonara. What the hell is that? Oh, this is Blythe! 
Yo! Are the enemies still following me? Yeah, they are. Blythe! What if I hide behind them? Will that do anything? If I hide behind him and they shoot at him instead of me... Will he attack them? I'm actually kind of curious. Oh no, he's he's stepping away. He's like, no, 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 no. I'm not gonna do all that. Damn, he's taking his frustrations out on the air. Blythe, what's up, bro? Oh. Good to see you. Nice to see you as well. Apologies, mate. But I don't have much to report. Okay. I can see bloody Nocron right above me. But I'm absolutely stunned. Where? I've tried all the gateways. To no avail. Perhaps it's time to ask Celebus. I recall that spiteful little rat acting like he knew something. Oh, call them a rat? Oh, shit! They actually... They actually hit him. <laughs> and he's in, he's in an attack position, too. He's ready to fuck him up. Ah, oh, my God. I got to... All oh, right. Hold on. Perhaps it's time to recall that. <laughs> Let's give him... Show him just how sharp my teeth I are. Just decides. Uh, I just decides. I just. Leave this place to me. You just do what you feel is right. If either of us learns anything, we tell the other. Right? You got it. Leave this place to me. If either of us. Okay. Yeah. He's just respeating. Respeating. Yeah. Yeah. Respeating. Exactly. <laughs> my English is phenomenal, guys. You don't have to worry about a thing. What happens if I do use this? Do use this? Why can't I speak? It's the heat. I'm having a stroke. Oh my goodness. I knew it. But where does this take me? I mean, I'll take that. Don't get me wrong. But it's not like there's anything else here, right? I mean, obviously there has to be something here if we can get to this spot. Yeah, there's this little thing. That's it. A stone sword key. I was about to say, if it was a fucking arteria leaf, I was going to lose it. Made me do all this work. Hello? Okay. My game just decided to lag out for no reason. Alright. Okay. I might... I might be screwed. I don't think I can get out of this. Okie dokes. Back on solid ground and in front of another altar. I just gotta make my time count. Because I need to run. I'm not trying to fight all of you guys. It's so much easier just to run away. Alright, alright, alright. And then the next one would be more towards the middle of this area? This section? I should think. Aha, there it is. Dude, easy peasy. We're already on number four. We're gonna get the next four in like five seconds. This is gonna be the easiest video that I've done thus far. Oh my god, that guy shot a fucking bullet through my heart. Let me go. I hate those little orbs that fly around with the electricity on them. Them shits suck. Oh wow. I got a lot of do kiss booba. There isn't one over here, right? No. It does not look like there is. So I'm out of here. And then I guess we just continue on. Boom. Okay, I didn't grab that one, but... I don't really care much to uh, try and grab it. Look at this guy. Look at this bozo. If he's a phantom too... Okay. So he doesn't bleed. Or at least maybe I just didn't proc him. But that's kind of, like, hard to believe. Ow, what the fuck? That's kind of hard to believe, considering that my shit procs bleed really quick. Doesn't look like it, though. Let me drink some Estus real quick. Dude, that's not even the right thing. It's the Crimson Tears. I've been playing so many different Souls games. I've been playing Neo 2. I've tried uh, starting Bloodborne again. Um, like, I'm playing... Dark Souls 1 on, on the Switch. It's just... I'm all over the place. I, like... <laughs> I don't know what's what. Alright. If I'm not mistaken, however, there is a merchant here. And... You already know. I'll definitely, uh... 
take that merchant's bells off of his hands. Look at him. Playing music by himself. So sad. What are you selling? Ooh, a customer. What you got? What you got? A cookbook. What is this? Soap? Oil pot and roped oil pot. I'll buy that. And this one is cured meat, white cured meat. I'll buy that too. Um, he's got soap. I'll buy all of your soap. And I will buy all of your dwelling arrows. And then I will Goodbye. kill you where so you stand. Next. There is no next time. I'm sorry. Why? Why? Very simple. You have the worst spawns of any merchant in any game ever. And it is easier to kill you and take your bell bearing and give it to the merchant in my hub rather than come back to you every single time I want to buy dwelling arrows or soap or whatever the fuck. It's a waste of time. I'm not, sh I'm not quite sure why... Uh, from software did that, but hey, you know what more power to them, I guess If they if they like doing that they like making the game a little bit more difficult a little less uh, convenient Good for them Ow. Dude, I'm telling you they're the worst they are the worst Oh look at that and then you guys disappear, right? Perfect. This guy's not even, like, looking at me the right way. Piece of cake. Love it. Where are my souls? What the hell? All the way over there. A little strange, but... I guess I won't complain. I guess I'm used to Neo 2. Um, being... Like... It just... Your souls drop right where you die. Which is kind of convenient, kind of not. Because let's say you die in a really, really tough area. You have to go there. It's not going to be like, yeah, we put your souls like a little bit behind so you could grab it. No, it, it, it doesn't work like that. Right, all right. And I think, yep, the last one is up there. Got to get this asshole. Square off. There wasn't anything down here, right? No, perfect. Oh yeah, nice. And so I can light up this bonfire right here. And then I can take this little portal backwards. These two bon bonfires. Bon Dito bonfire. Here I come my Encina man. Thank you. Can't I walk on this? I cannot walk on that. I believe I lit the last fire, and I just want to run over this way real quick. I hate these dudes with a passion. Yep, because they do that. All right, gotta go, gotta go, gotta go, gotta go, gotta go. Um, I want to unlock this little area before I head backwards, because I'm pretty sure that there is a bonfire on the top of wherever this elevator leads. Side of Grace, not a bonfire. God damn it. And so I really want to see where that takes me again because I just can't remember. I think this takes me to a point in Caleb, right? Or am I mistaken there too? I guess we're going to find out. This is also another thing that I really liked. Um, I like the aesthetic of uh, this floor this panel just lighting up and the little like ethereal essence that just takes the there's no like physics behind it it just takes you up for some reason but it's so pretty to look at oh okay so this is the um this is the area before the the giant pot where you get the arsenal um talisman for like weight and whatnot all right perfect okay so we're gonna save there and we are gonna go back boom just fast travel i don't really need my souls because like it's only 
what, 900 souls I got left? We're gonna go fuck up this giant antler. This giant antler. I am losing it, dude. I'm telling you that this heat is just killing me. It's a giant deer. A giant buck. Or a moose of some sort. But he's going down. That's my ninja way. That's my nindo. That's my fortnite.gg slash the nindo. Alright. There he is. A beautiful boss. I will say that much. Gorgeous. I can't call my horse, but I can call these. Help me out here, boys. The music is just so elegant. The boss is so beautiful to look at. It's not a particularly difficult boss, to be honest. Ow. I say as I get fucking stomped into next week. There we go, there we go. Put in the work, boys. <sighs> Lord have mercy. Ancestral follower ashes and ancestor spirit. I got a trophy. Look at that. Well, guys, we have put in some work. It wasn't a lot of work, but it was work nonetheless. And I hope you guys did enjoy hearing me talk. I hope I was able to soothe you to sleep. I know you guys use my videos to fall asleep. I know it's basically like ASMR, so you don't have to lie to me. All right. I love you. It's okay. But yeah, that's going to be it for me for today. I love you guys. Stay safe, and I'll catch you in the next one. Deuces.